The 10 year old girl with failing lungs and only weeks left to live finally has a ray of hope. A court ruling on Wednesday gives Sarah Murnahan a shot at survival. Sarah suffers from cystic fibrosis and needs a lung transplant to survive. She's at the top of the children's transplant list, but pediatric lung donations are very rare, and Sarah is too young to apply for an adult organ. Her parents have appealed to Health and Human Services Secretary Kathleen Sebelius to ignore the age limit, but Sebelius refused to override the transplant system already in place. The Murnahans then sued Sebelius. On Wednesday, Judge Michael Bailson granted a 10-day injunction ordering Sebelius to suspend the age limit until the court can review the case further. CNN reports doctors now have 10 days to find a lung for Sarah, which is exactly what Sarah's parents were hoping for. They basically wanted Sarah to have the same opportunity to compete, if you will, for a lung. If a match can be found, there, there's a possibility that Sarah's life could be saved. While this decision is definitely a wonderful result for Sarah and her family, the court's decision to override existing transplant procedures has some medical professionals worried. As one doctor tells WDIV, the judge's ruling sets an uncomfortable new precedent. There is a federal court essentially deciding how organs should be distributed, yeah, yeah. and that is something that is going to need to be thought about more thoroughly. And a bioethics professor writing for NBC says the life and death decision should be made by the doctors who have all the proper information, not by politicians. The rules that exist for saving lives are not random. They are meant to increase the odds of saving the most lives with a very scarce supply of organs. When a lot of lives hang in the balance and the facts determining who is most likely to live are complicated, Washington is the last place to turn for answers about who should live. Now that she has access to adult organs, Sarah's parents estimate a 75% chance of finding her a suitable pair of lungs. Keep your fingers crossed. For Newsy, I'm Bryce Sander.